Hello, knowledge seekers. In this episode of 20 Minute Books, we delve into Joy on Demand by Chade Mengtan, a transformative exploration that illuminates the path to attaining sustained happiness through meditation. This guide, published in 2016, lays out a straightforward, accessible program designed to convert moments of despair into opportunities for optimism, leading practitioners towards a place of inner peace, calm, and, ultimately, joy. Shada Mengtan, who began his career as an engineer, experienced a profound personal transformation as he discovered his spiritual side. Now, as a best-selling author and acclaimed creator of several popular mindfulness courses, he shares his journey and insights on achieving joy with a global audience. Joy on Demand is not just a manual for meditation. It is a beacon for anyone swamped by the tides of depression and anxiety, for workaholics and chronic worriers, and for those simply seeking to enhance their spiritual journey. This book promises wisdom for all aspiring spiritual souls and anyone longing to rediscover happiness in their everyday lives. Join us as we explore how Shade Mengtan's teachings can unlock the door to a more joyous existence. Joy on Demand, The Art of Discovering the Happiness Within Introduction, Unlocking the Door to Happiness Through Meditation Are you bathing in the sunshine of joy, or are you occasionally shadowed by clouds of gloom? It's a question that fluctuates with the tides of life, and your response might vary with the passing seasons. However, irrespective of the weather in your heart, there's a timeless and cost-free method to usher in more warmth and happiness, meditation. While many of us recognize meditation as a valuable ally against stress and a booster rocket for our performance, its spectrum of benefits stretches far beyond these realms. Meditation holds the key to profoundly enhancing our well-being and happiness, unlocking levels of joy we might have thought were out of reach. This exploration will reveal the reasons behind the familiar feeling that we've not evolved much since our teenage years, the necessity of training our minds to be more acquainted with joy, and the intriguing truth that nurturing feelings of love towards a stranger can significantly amplify our happiness. Embark on this journey to discover how meditation can transform your life, offering a direct pathway to a richer, fuller state of happiness. Part 1. Steadying the Happiness Scale with the Power of Meditation Imagine visiting a palm reader who, after a meticulous examination of your hands, suggests your journey is steeped in gloom until you miraculously turn 40. Such was the tale of a man who, misunderstanding the palm reader's foresight, believed his 40th year would bring with it a wave of newfound happiness. The reality, however, was not a promise of joy, but an acceptance of his perennial state of misery. This anecdote mirrors a broader human condition. Across the globe, individuals' happiness levels seem to hover around a consistent mean throughout their lives. Our incredible adaptability allows us to quickly revert to our baseline happiness after experiencing peaks of joy or valleys of despair. Consider this. A study in 1978 by Philip Brickman unveiled that life-altering events such as winning a lottery or experiencing a life-changing accident have little to no long-term impact on our happiness levels. Similarly, David Licken's 1996 twin study suggested that a whopping 50% of our happiness could be chalked up to genetics, rendering external factors like wealth or education relatively insignificant in the grand scheme of our emotional well-being. The conclusion from such findings seems bleak. If one is genetically predisposed to unhappiness, there's little room for improvement. But this is far from the truth. Just like the physical body can be toned and strengthened through exercise, the mind, too, can be cultivated to enhance feelings of joy and resilience. This was a revelation the author stumbled upon through the ancient practice of meditation. Establishing a meditation practice is likened to embarking on a physical fitness journey for the mind. It builds mental fortitude, 
enabling a more consistent experience of joy and contentment, irrespective of external circumstances. However, just as muscles take time to build, so does the capacity for sustained happiness through meditation. The challenge often lies in committing to regular meditation. Yet, understanding the substantial payoff and uplift in your baseline happiness can be the motivation needed to prioritize this transformative practice. Journeying through these insights, we uncover the blueprint for not just surviving but thriving through the mindful art of meditation. Part 2 The Unseen Gifts of Meditation From Serenity to Strength Embarking on the path of meditation is akin to introducing a new workout routine into your life. It might be daunting at first, but the rewards it yields are profound and multifold. One of the initial treasures unearthed through consistent meditation practice is the gift of deep, unwavering calm. This tranquility isn't immediate. It requires patience and perseverance. Initially, meditators find themselves entangled in the same whirlwind of thoughts that frequently occupy the mind. However, with time and dedication, the ability to quiet these thoughts during meditation sessions becomes a reality. This newfound power isn't confined to the moments of meditation alone. It begins to seep into everyday life, offering solace and serenity amid chaos. Take, for instance, a student of the author who, after just a few weeks of committed meditation practice, mastered the art of restraint, sparing him and his in laws from potential discord. Yet, the boons of meditation extend beyond cultivating calm. It fosters emotional resilience, equipping individuals with the strength to bounce back from adversities. Imagine encountering a setback as severe as losing your job. Without emotional resilience, such an event could lead to anxiety, spiraling worry, or worse. Meditation counters these impulses, teaching us to meet our distress with a calm mind, recognizing the transient nature of our emotions. This skill transforms the way we interact with our feelings. Rather than being at the mercy of our emotional currents, we learn to accept and understand them. This acceptance not only diminishes the emotional turmoil, but also clears the mind, enabling us to focus on constructive responses to our challenges, be it seeking new employment opportunities or contemplating a career shift. Meditation, therefore, unveils a spectrum of benefits from ushering in peace to building emotional fortitude. At this juncture, you might wonder about the time frame required to reap these rewards. The answer to that, as we'll explore, might surprise you with its accessibility. Part 3. The Swift Path to Joy Through Meditation Delving into the world of meditation might initially seem daunting, akin to learning a new language or picking up a musical instrument for the first time. However, the journey towards integrating meditation into your daily routine may be smoother and more rewarding than anticipated, thanks mainly to the potent catalyst of joy. Imagine reaching a pivotal moment in your meditation practice, a moment the author uniquely identifies as the joy point. This moment marks a significant transition. From here on, you can tap into a wellspring of joy almost effortlessly during your sessions. The beauty of the joy point lies in its self-propelling nature. Once you experience the bliss it offers, your motivation to continue the practice multiplies, setting you on an ascending spiral towards greater joy and satisfaction. The prospect of achieving such a state may appear distant, but the path to joy through meditation is shorter and more accessible than many assume. Take the example of participants in mindfulness-based programs who report discernible psychological improvements in just a few weeks of practice. While individual experiences with meditation vary, the consensus is clear. The benefits of meditation are within reach much sooner than one might imagine. Drawing from his interactions with students, the author suggests that around 100 hours of dedicated meditation practice could usher in noticeable improvements. Echoing this sentiment with a more optimistic forecast, the Dalai Lama proposes that as little as 50 hours of practice could manifest positive changes. Supporting these anecdotal insights, a study conducted in 2007 by Chinese psychologist Y.Y. Tan revealed 
that a mere 100 minutes of meditation were sufficient to enhance concentration, instill calm, and uplift overall happiness. The message is unequivocal. Meditation holds the promise of eliciting rapid joy, provided there is commitment to the practice. The question of how to embark on this transformative journey looms next, preparing us to unveil the actionable steps towards cultivating a life enriched with joy. Part 4. A Single Breath. The Gateway to Meditation's Miracles. After exploring the profound impacts of a dedicated meditation practice, you might be pondering the minimal entry point to experiencing its wonders. Prepare to be intrigued, for the answer lies within the reach of your very next breath. Indeed, the magic begins with a simple act, a solitary cycle of inhalation and exhalation. Skeptical? Embark on a brief experiment. Whether you choose the path of closed eyes or a gaze soft and unfocused, inhale slowly and deeply, letting your awareness gently cradle the movement of air in and out of your body. A noticeable shift occurs for many at the culmination of this soul breath, a sudden plunge into calmness, a subtle lifting of tension's weight. But what unfolds in this seemingly trivial exercise to bring about such serenity? The explanation resides in two fundamental shifts, primarily mindful breathing, characterized by its depth and deliberateness, cues your parasympathetic nervous system into action. This part of your nervous system acts as a serene counterbalance to stress, nurturing, repair and relaxation throughout your body. Furthermore, focusing on your breath acts as an anchor momentarily suspending the ceaseless tide of past regrets and future anxieties. In this brief pause you find respite, a fleeting sanctuary from the storms of life, courtesy of the present moment's embrace. The implications of this simple practice are far-reaching. Consider the elite athletes of the world for whom recovery and rejuvenation are not luxuries but necessities. Tennis virtuoso Novak Djokovic, for example, attributes part of his monumental success on the global stage to mindful breathing exercises conducted in the ephemeral stillness between points. This practice, seemingly innocuous, harnesses the rejuvenating power of mindfulness, offering glimpses of its potential to elevate performance to legendary heights. Thus, the journey into meditation's transformative potential begins with a single breath. But where do we go from here? How can we extend this momentary peace into a sustained state of well-being? Part 5. Embarking on a deeper meditation journey with anchors and rest. Imagine stepping into a vault filled to the brim with currency, where you're granted the liberty to take as much as you can hold. Naturally, you wouldn't just pocket a few coins and leave. You'd aim for more. This analogy perfectly illustrates the journey of meditation where the initial experience of calm from a single breath represents merely the tip of the iceberg. The true treasure lies in delving deeper. Progressing from the simple yet profound starting point requires understanding and applying the foundational concept of meditation, settling the mind through anchoring. This entails choosing a focal point to return your attention to, serving as a stable base amidst the whirlwind of thoughts. While the breath, constant and inherently calming, stands as a primary and effective anchor, you are at liberty to select alternative focal points. These can range from bodily sensations to external stimuli such as sounds, sights or tactile sensations. Imagine your mind as a snow globe, shaken by the day's events. Anchoring allows the flurry of thoughts to gradually settle, revealing a clear, tranquil panorama. This state of clarity and expanded perspective is one of the most precious offerings of meditation. However, if anchoring proves challenging at the outset, there's an alternative route, embracing rest. It might sound deceptively simple, but in our fast-paced, always-on culture, true rest is a rare commodity and a formidable endeavor. To practice resting, let your mind drift toward tranquility. Picture serene landscapes or the gentle rhythms of nature. Alternatively, adopt a mantra, a concise, repetitive phrase imbued with calm, such as, 
I don't need to go anywhere or do anything. In this moment, all I need to do is rest. Whether you commence your meditation journey with anchoring or by practicing rest, you're setting the stage for profound peace. But peace is just the beginning. The path ahead unwinds towards even greater realms of joy. In our subsequent exploration, we will delve into advancing from this foundational calm towards embracing and embodying true joy. Part 6. Discovering Joy in the Minutiae, a Pathway to Happiness Imagine water cascading down a gentle slope, effortlessly following its natural course. Analogously, your journey towards joy requires a predisposition towards happiness, a readiness to embrace it wherever it may appear. The initial phase in nurturing this inclination is to acquaint your mind with the sensation of joy, akin to welcoming a new friend into your life's inner circle. This process is rooted in the understanding that familiarity breeds recognition. The more your mind encounters joy, the more adept it becomes at identifying and even seeking out these moments, fostering an environment ripe for happiness to flourish. Indeed, the word familiar shares its etymology with family, suggesting a depth of closeness and intimacy. By integrating joy into your mental family, you develop a profound connection with it, allowing it to become a recognizable and frequent guest in the narrative of your life. To harness this familiarity, commence by being alert to instances of happiness, no matter how transient or subtle they may be. It's akin to spotting blue cars on a freeway. Initially, they might meld into the multicolored traffic stream, but with purposeful awareness, their presence becomes more pronounced. Consider the everyday joy of stepping into a warm shower. It's a fleeting pleasure that many of us let slip through our fingers immersed in the rush of daily routines. Recognizing and savoring such simple delights is an act of mindfulness, a deliberate pausing to let the warmth and comfort truly embrace us. By cherishing these moments, you embark on the first leg of the journey towards happiness. Acknowledging the ubiquity of joy in your life lays the groundwork for a deeper, more sustained experience of contentment. Yet the exploration doesn't end here. There exists another potent practice to augment your encounters with joy, a method we will delve into next, offering another key to unlock the treasure chest of happiness. Part 7. Healing with the Heart, Love, Compassion, and Meditation. It's a universal truth. Bad days happen, often catching us off guard with their persistence. Yet, within the depths of meditation lies a powerful, transformative practice capable of converting even the dreariest of days into opportunities for empathy and joy. Imagine the transformative power of redirecting your focus towards thoughts of loving kindness, a practice that can quite literally rewire your day from the inside out. Here's a simple yet profound exercise. In any public setting where people are around, Mentally select two individuals and silently wish them true and deep happiness. Such an exercise, though seemingly modest, packs a profound impact. The author recounts an instance where participants were asked to perform this gesture of goodwill hourly during a regular workday. The feedback was astonishing, with one participant, typically disenchanted with her job, reporting that the exercise led to her happiest day in seven years. Through this process, you're not just altering your own mood, you're indirectly fostering a mental environment where joy can flourish. But the influence of meditation doesn't stop with amplifying positive emotions. It also offers a sanctuary from the negative. Whenever you find yourself ensnared by adverse feelings, revert to the foundational meditative skills previously discussed. Gently guide your focus back to your chosen anchor be it your breath or another point of calm, and allow peace to seep back into your mind. Once tranquility is restored, confront the emotional upheaval head on. Identify the emotion stoking the inner turmoil, then consciously feed it its antithesis. For example, envision your anger as a tangible creature within you, 
feeding on your fury and swelling with each spiteful thought. The impulse might be to shun this beast, but resistance only fuels its growth. The path to peace involves an unexpected strategy, befriending this inner demon, showering it with kindness and understanding. As your compassion radiates inward, visualize the creature, your anger, diminishing in size and ferocity, morphing from foe to friend. This comprehensive toolkit, anchoring yourself in the present, seeking joy in the lives of others, and neutralizing negativity with compassion, arms you with everything needed to cultivate a life brimming with happiness. Remaining mindful and embracing each moment with a heart full of love paves the way to a life where joy is not just fleeting, but a constant companion. Final Summary In the vast landscape of human emotion, joy often appears like a mirage, always on the horizon but seemingly out of reach. Yet this perception couldn't be further from the truth. Genuine, lasting happiness is within arm's reach, waiting to be embraced. The bridge to this promised land? Meditation. Embarking on a meditation journey is not about chanting mystical mantras or achieving an elusive state of enlightenment. Rather, it's about cultivating a daily practice that centers around presence, mindfulness, and compassion. Through regular, dedicated practice, Meditation reveals itself not just as a pathway to temporary tranquility, but as a conduit to profound, enduring joy. Whether it's learning to cherish the fleeting moments of happiness in everyday life, or using meditation to transform negative emotions through love and compassion, the essence of this transformative practice is clear. Meditation doesn't ask you to seek joy in distant places or future accomplishments. It teaches you to uncover it right where you are, in the here and now. In essence, joy isn't just a distant dream. It's a present possibility. With meditation as your guide, the journey towards a life filled with more serenity, resilience, and unbounded joy begins with a single step, or more aptly, a single breath. Thank you for joining me today on this journey of learning and discovery as we explored the insights of another thought-provoking book in our growing library of knowledge. If you've enjoyed our time together, please take a moment to follow our podcast, give us a five-star rating, and share 20-minute books with other knowledge seekers. Your support truly means a lot. Don't forget to join me again in the next episode, where we will delve into another enriching book. Until then. Happy reading and happy listening.